okay meet Firulo. He's a pretty old character I never finished actually. But it was a lot of fun and I uh, and I got to practice a lot of different techniques for modeling and rigging which was really cool. As you can see on the modifier stack there is a lot of lattices there which are totally unneeded anymore. And uh, I used to, to use lattices for that when I was in um, Plumifers. And yeah, nowadays I will use another technique, I think. But back then it was fun. It has also some shape keys as well. I never did any animation for it. Um, I should have used for example the lattices were used for these kind of deformations I wanted him to be even if it's uh, all bones uh, to be flexible like when he smashes the the mouth or the, the head with a with a wall like really cartoony I love cartoony and also the, the rigging was meant to be flexible in terms that every piece should be available to be like free to be like standalone piece. Nothing should be attached. So he should be able to I mean if you want to blow him like to explode in pieces then you should be able to because it's fun <laughs> and it's all bones. So even the ears or the the head, the mouth, everything should be even I was thinking about the thief even so but now it's free so if you anyone any of you want to keep working on him oh these are the lattices it's oh, horrible as well a lot of them nowadays I will use some other <laughs> more modern techniques like mesh deform that will make things a lot easier but when in the blender version I used back then it wasn't possible also this character has two sub subsurf subdivision surface modifiers uh, first let me show you how it looks without them because why would you need two modifiers so let's disable here here As you can see it's really low poly, right? Not even on, on the eyes is the uh, less amount of polygons. For some reason I added a lot of polygons on the on the um, nose as well. But let me show you here. Uh, the first modifier is a uh, subdivision surface modifier soft surf, but with a simple subdivision type. So every face is now four faces, but it's not rounded anymore. The roundedness <laughs> comes with the um, with the second modifier which is a another subdivision surface modifier subsurf but this time with the Cadmul Clark uh, option which is an algorithm for making everything roundy and cool. <laughs> so I wanted to keep this style of like the rough edges and faces but also with a little bit of uh, a little bit rounded, not all really sharp. It also had some shape keys as well. I never used them, all of them, sadly. So only some of them are used in the rigging actually. All oh, the war, the yeah, the body is the same technique. I just model one of these uh, vertebs and just duplicate you know small pieces some of them were modified manually like to look like they were broken or something also two, mo two sub subdivision surface modifiers and, and it also has a curve modifier which I won't use probably nowadays 
but this was the new thing when I was uh, working on uh, Firulo, this, the curve modifier was the latest new addition there. So I was uh, really happy and I was working, <laughs> adding into everything I was working on, including Firulo. But nowadays I will probably not use that. And look at the uh, the amount of hooks modifiers I'm using there. It's insane. You should know. <laughs> you should don't do that. Yeah, please don't do that. It's horrible. Uh, okay, the ribs. <laughs> uh, they are all only one piece. They're just du uh, duplicated, linked, and placed by hand. Uh, manually. This also is not really special. Just a simple model. Oh, and the little bones. Those are the most simple things on the Firulo. Really simple. I didn't want it to, to look too much detail. And uh, I probably started from a cylinder or something like this. Because they're pretty simple. Mostly because they wanted all the bones to look really similar and simple. And oh, jeez, look at the feet. <laughs> okay, nowadays I will probably do a little bit more detailed version of it. But it was back then, 2006, I think. I can't remember. But yeah. But now it's free, it's Creative Commons, so anybody can uh, can take care of him. Everyone is free to to open it, to open it, to share it, to change it, to modify, to upload it everywhere, to do whatever you want. But consider giving away what you have changed, so everybody can take, can use it and can learn from it. So that was uh, Lula.